Hi, this is Damien Merry from Fine and Country Oxfordshire with my Property House and Market Report, July 2021. It's a record sale to stock ratio. And as the stamp duty holiday price threshold drops in England, Northern Ireland and Wales, the housing market demand remains above pre-pandemic levels. A record sale to stock ratio for agents has contributed to a 13% annual house price increase in June. This is the highest level since November 2004. In all regions of the UK, except for London, house prices have increased. Uh, 16% in the Southwest, 15% in the Midlands, 14% in the Northwest and 14% here in the Southeast in Oxfordshire, year on year. From 1st of July, the stamp duty holiday threshold to £180,000 in Wales. And the stamp duty holiday was introduced in July 2020, designed to boost housing market demand following the closure of the market between March and May 2020. The combination of the stamp duty holiday and households undertaking and re-evaluating has caused a huge rise in demand, leading to record house growth. Buyer demand continues to outstrip availability and the number of homes for sale in the first six months of 2021 was 24% lower compared to this time last year. One fifth of agents stayed at the most homes sell in less than a week, reporting the current market is the fastest moving for five years. The average time taken to sell a property from marketing to sold is 22 days, nearly half the 42 days recorded in 2019. Demand is currently strongest for properties priced up to the new £250,000 threshold that remains buoyant across all price brackets. The number of uh, sales agreed on properties over 500,000 was 49% higher than 2019. Despite further stamp duty threshold change, it is estimated that 1.5 million property sales were complete in 2021. Just 4% of purchasers say they would abandon plans to buy a property if they missed the stamp duty deadline in September, although 1 in 4 are likely to try and negotiate on the price with that seller. Sales agreed are now 17% ahead of the same period in 2019 compared to 45% in April. And transaction levels in May fell by 3.8% compared to April. A slight slowdown following the original stamp duty holiday deadline. However, transactions were still 17% higher than 2014 uh, to 19 average. Mortgage approvals in May uh, were 34% higher. Um, point 7% higher than in April. I uh, hope you find this uh, information useful and I'll be back next month with another update. This is Damien Merry from Finding Country Oxfordshire.